I'm Trisha Keen right now on your 13 Action News update. You don't have to wear a badge to be a hero. Today is the start of National Donate Life Month. And now local law enforcement agencies, along with Governor Steve Sisolak and first responders, are teaming up to encourage more people to become everyday heroes by registering to become organ donors. Currently, more than 600 Nevadans are waiting for their second chance at life. To find out how you can become an organ donor, go to ktnv.com slash links. And right now, Nevadans 50 years and older, along with certain immunocompromised people, can now get their second COVID-19 booster shot. The state making that announcement today, and this comes after the CDC and USDA approved it earlier this week. To find out where you can get your second booster, go to ktnv.com slash COVID-19 vaccine. A new exhibit brings you the history of the wedding capital of the world. It's called Forever Happens Here, creating the wedding capital of the world. It will feature an overview of the early days of the Las Vegas wedding industry starting in 1909. The exhibit launches Tuesday, April 5th and runs through May 4th. It's free and is open at the Clark County Government Center Rotunda from 7.30 a.m. to 5.30 p.m. Monday through Thursday. Danny. Happy Friday. Fantastic conditions today with a high of 80 degrees at Reed International and plenty of sunshine this afternoon. Sky remains clear tonight with calm wind and we hang on to the 70s through dinner time. Very quiet conditions taking us into Saturday morning with cool temperatures. We'll wake up to upper 50s on Saturday before those highs jump another 5 degrees, putting us 10 above the seasonal average. 85 degrees, a mostly sunny sky on Saturday, but it is a bit on the breezy side. A weak front moving through that adds in some cloud cover and drops temperatures Sunday. We stick with the 80s heading into next week. And that was your 13 Action News update. You can always get the latest news at KTNV.com.